As the elevator rises, you pause for a moment to catch your breath. Both Franz Gross and the Warmach Colonel are dead, but you know the worst terrors of Totenhouse still lay ahead. Terrors that until now have been little more than rumors, since no actual witnesses to them have ever escaped to confirm them. But terrors that you know include the remaining Gross siblings and General Scheisskopf himself. I believe I pronounced some of those correctly, I don't really know. But, uh, yeah, uh, I didn't realize this little intermission screen was going to show up until, uh, after I stopped recording last time. So, this is actually not our real save. This is our real save right here. Floor 3-1, which is where we're starting our adventure today. So, uh, yeah. By the way, this is Escape from Toten House, in case you didn't know. Let's begin. I hear... Okay, uh, right off the bat, that's not bad. So yes, Franz Gross is probably the red guy, I would have to guess. So there's more. I knew, I read on the website that there were more Gross siblings. So I guess we're gonna see them. Okay. This is very, very similar to the previous level. I can already say that much, but uh, I mean, it's not a horrible thing. But, uh, let's just keep going. Still have shit tons of armor. So we're looking pretty damn good right now, I would, if, I, if I do say so myself. But, you know... Oh man, this is a... this is a... oh my god, this place is huge! All right, so Bronski door's yeah. there. Let's just, yeah. yeah. I say we explore as much of this outer perimeter as possible, because uh, there's lots to explore here apparently. Yeah. This is all a gold key room apparently. Okay, that's good to know. I think yeah, we came from there. Okay, well okay, it's not too much to explore. We really only have like a couple of options here. Um, okay, so let's go around and. Check out this open, or this unlocked door, this not locked door. Oh, wait. Oh, there's that way over there, too. Let's check this, though. Oh, God. <laughs> More hallways. More, oh, of course, the core Nazis. And the door Nazis. Almost one after the other every fucking time, man. Okay. Oof. Okay. Yeah, at this point, with all this health and armor, I don't really give a fuck. I'm just gonna just blaze through these fuckers. Yeah, shoot me all you want. This is not the first level anymore. I feel pretty confident at this point. Oh god, there's way more doors to open. Um, it all seems to be leading into the central area here, but I guess there's also this side to check out. But, um, let's start in here. Oh, these are all individual offices. Okay, never mind. Yeah. Well, there's gonna be there's gonna be something in some of these. I don't know if there's gonna be secrets or not, really. But whoa, where'd you come from? Ah, let's just go across. Yeah. Anything in here? Nothing at all. Just Nazi closets, I guess you could say. Ooh. Well, there's... <sighs> Just in case, for whatever reason, I just gotta be mindful of that. Although, I doubt I'm gonna go below 100% health this level. I don't know, I just have a feeling that I'm gonna be fine. <laughs> but... <clears throat> oh, shit. Yeah! Yeah! Okay, well, I was a little bit reckless with the machine gun. Yeah! <laughs> Apparently, BGA agrees with me. Uh, well, at least now we have a silver key. At least we stumbled across, uh, across? Apostrophe? At least we stumbled across an apostrophe, apparently. I don't know what the hell I'm saying at this point. Yeah. I'd like to find some more machine gun, though. That'd be nice. Yeah. Well, like that, yeah. Um, yeah! Just like that, yeah! Um, okay. <laughs> Uh, it never gets old, man. At least for me. <laughs> I don't know about you guys. Uh, let's check the other office real quick, just in case. I mean, I know we have a key and everything. Yeah. There we go. Okay. Yeah. 
Oh, see, there you go. I, I, I always figure yeah. some of these rooms have ammo. Okay, so, uh, well, there's a whole other room here. Yeah, let's check it out. Let's leave no stone unturned. Okay, it's looking pretty good. Hopefully we find some ammo boxes at some point. I mean, that'd be nice. Okay, let's go check out these silver key doors. And pro- oh! Yeah! There was a whole machine gun just sitting there waiting for me. Okay. Let's just keep moving. Let's just try to at least make our shots count, you know? And come on out. Yeah. Yeah. Nothing in here. Yeah. These rooms are very similar, though. Yeah. I would not be surprised to find a key in one of these. Yeah. Or nothing. Nothing at all. I mean, you know, that's how it goes sometimes. Uh, let's see. Well, there's plenty of rooms to open. If I may offer a little bit of criticism, um, it seems like this level in particular is just sort of a, okay, these, these areas are pretty much designed the same way. Which one has the key in it? Although, at the same time, thinking back, that's pretty much, that was also kind of Astrostein in some, at least some of the, uh, some of the more, uh, linear levels of Astrostein were a lot like that, where, um, I mean, like, there were some Astro Sign levels that were nice and open and, you know, worth exploring, but then there were other Astro Sign levels that were pretty much just, you know, fortresses. And all that was in them was just very symmetrical levels. And pretty much what we're seeing here, like, go in, go in the new key area and see what you can find. And, you know, where, where will the key be hidden this time? That sort of thing, you know? But, uh, yeah, just a minor gripe yeah. about, about Wolf and Doom. Now, okay, this room has multiple gold keys heading into it. If it is one room, I mean, it could very well be multiple offices like before. Nope, it's not. A giant conference room. Now this would be quite a difficult room if it didn't have all this armor. Lots of bratwurst in here. Got you know, the moment yeah. I don't need bratwurst is when I start seeing it everywhere. Okay, now then, let's get the hell out of here. Because I imagine this key is going to lead us to the exit. Um, we didn't explore those other rooms, but I don't really think we need to. I mean, this is one of the most symmetrical Wolf and Doom levels I've ever seen, to be completely honest. And, uh... Yep. What kind of armor are you wearing? Are you wearing my kind of armor? I mean, shit. Ah. There's a classic Wolfenstein trick there. Yeah. Stick a guy into the elevator. Okay. Well, there you go. That was 3-1. Pretty straightforward. But, uh, hopefully we'll see some more crazy shit as we go along in this floor. Anyway, thanks for watching. And I'll see you in the next episode of Wolfendoom's, uh, what am I going with this? <laughs> Wolf and Doom's Escape from Toten House, I guess I was trying to say. Uh, you're screwing up the outro, John. What the fuck? Anyway, I'll see you then. Later.